Welcome to Exo News TV. I'm Michael Sala. In February 2009, NASA's Spirit Rover navigation camera took a sequence of four images over a 13 day period that showed what appears to be an animal moving near a distinctive set of rocks on Mars. The object appears to have a relatively large head and blends in well with the surrounding rocks. In the first shot of the sequence, taken on Sol 1830, there is no object between the two relatively large boulders. In the second shot, taken three days later, there is now an object between the same two large boulders. In the third shot, again taken three days later, the object is now gone. Where did it go? In the final shot, taken a week later on Sol 1843, we see another object similar to the first, this time to the left of the boulders, an object about the size of a basketball had moved not once but twice in the sequence. Not so, according to some who claim the images are simply different camera perspectives of the rock formation that show a rock previously obscured by a larger rock. Such an explanation falls short, however, since the changing camera perspective is not that great, even though several days had elapsed between Spirit Rover shots. As composite shots of the four images show, the location of the Spirit Rover and the perspective it has of the rocks in question has not changed greatly over the 13 day period over which they were taken. It's pretty hard to ignore NASA's own imagery that clearly shows a basketball sized object appearing to move on the Martian surface. So why hasn't NASA said anything officially about it? I thought I would give someone from NASA a chance to respond. On May 15, I posted on the NASA affiliated science forum nasaspaceflight.com to get expert feedback about the sequence of Spirit Rover images. I wrote, There is a sequence of images by the Spirit Rover over an approximate week that show a distinctive set of rocks. An object appears in the sequence. Some claim it is an indigenous form of life. I'd like some expert opinion on what it is. My post was quickly removed and I was banned from the forum. The reason given was that the forum does not discuss UFOs, yet in my request for feedback about the Spirit Rover images, I didn't mention UFOs. Clearly, space experts do not want to discuss questions arising from NASA's own scientific instruments that suggest possible life on Mars, let alone the existence of UFOs. The four images from the Spirit Rover mission is hard evidence that shows an object that has clearly moved in the sequence. The object appears to be some kind of animal that blends in well with the surrounding rock. The images are very clear and stunning in their implications, yet NASA experts refuse to discuss such a possibility. Why? The most obvious conclusion to draw is that there is some kind of indigenous life roaming the surface of Mars and NASA doesn't want you to know about it.